Hello, let me show you this new tutorial number 7 part 2. I have added a new point here in the side view which is corresponding one in the front view is this one. Okay, then I'm going to do the same things that need the other to show you how it works. I will select these bones also to try to achieve this length as a rotation radius ok let's remove the strength Now the, let's prepare this one, okay? Put it vertically and uh, put the constraints. Now let's check if it works. Okay, are now the small springy bones. And now let's check if they work. Okay. Let's uh, put this one prepared to be in the middle of the stroke. Okay. So go to na frame number one. Okay, frame number one. Make a rotation was the map of the master bone in 90 degree negative 90 degrees okay select these bones and make a click and copy the keyframe copy paste and delete so they are already prepared to be rotated to achieve this angle, okay? Okay, so let's go to the frame number one and make a rotation to this bone until this bone reach this direction and this orientation. Okay, for the moment it's okay. Then let's make it modify the length of the springy mechanism. Again in the frame number zero, uh, one, sorry.
okay this is okay and this is more or less okay and then select all the ones and make a click for the angle make a click for the angle okay and copy paste and the same for the length copy and paste and the light okay so let's put the bond in another place And now let's uh, contract this one in order to be pointing to you. Okay, this is uh, the springy mechanism who is going to be a length of zero when the angle is zero also. Go to frame number one. Okay, and then make a minus 90 degrees. and select all these ones make a click and copy and paste and delete ok and now we have to add a bone here and to, to link to this mechanism <coughs> Okay, so let's link it to this one and let's link this one to this one. Okay, who is the 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 bone who is making the make the movement of this mechanism? Now let's check that the in frame number one this bone will be will move okay and we have to restore the position with this tool okay more or less so let's check how it works now you can see that there is a virtual three-dimensional rotation in two angles okay of this side view two points with the blue line in the mid in the center i hope you enjoy this tutorial thank you bye